Brennan is actually packing the car with them right now. There he is. Hi, Brennan. Um, I cannot let a family cruise go without creating a theme and a logo. I hope we have enough ink to last. It's almost been 12 hours. All right, you guys. Can you tell that I'm totally, like, losing it? Good morning, everybody. Welcome to today's vlog. I am headed to the office supply store because we are going on a cruise this afternoon. Well, not this afternoon. Today, this afternoon, we're flying to Seattle and jumping on the cruise ship tomorrow. And this is kind of an epic cruise because it is not our immediate family. It is Mike and I and my parents, my sister and her husband, my and my two brothers and their wives. So this is an adult trip and we are cruising to Alaska. We've never been there before. We're so excited to go. This has been um, a total fun vacation to plan. And I'll tell you why. So my parents um, decided that they wanted to go to on a cruise to Alaska. Like the end of last year, they were like, all right, I'm booking a cruise to Alaska. And they told us all about like, oh, that sounds great, mom and dad. Hope you enjoy it. You know, they cruise, all, oh, not all the time, but frequently. And um, next thing you know, I get a call from my brother. He's like, yep, we joined the cruise. <laughs> like what? So of course my brother and his wife joined the cruise. So then my other brother and his wife joined the cruise. And I'm like, okay, this is how it's gonna go, right? So Mike and I joined and then my sister joined. So we are all going on this cruise together. And um, I cannot let a family cruise go without creating a theme and a logo and um, all kinds of gear to go with it. Um, if you guys have seen our family shirts, we number our family based on how you enter the family. So like I'm number seven because my parents are number one and two and then my older brothers and sisters are three, four, five, six. I'm number seven. And then my sister-in-law Michelle is number eight. So anyway, we do family t-shirts and that kind of thing. We're not doing family t-shirts with numbers this time because not everybody's gonna be there. Um, but we are doing t-shirts that I had a logo printed or created and I will show you guys. And um, and shirts made and I just could not imagine being on the ship and not having um, magnets on the doors with the same logo. And we just got back from Maryland yesterday and we're leaving today to fly out to Seattle. So my turn has been, we got in at 1230, one, two, three, I, I have exactly 11 and a half hours and only two and a half of those I slept. <laughs> I was up last night, like doing all kinds of stuff, really actually putting together my stuff to pack because I haven't even packed yet. So anyway, I am not able to find the store I'm looking for. It's in here somewhere. Oh, there it is. I passed it. Anywho, um, I am going to the office supply store because I was, I can't get anybody to print these signs quick enough because I need them like instantaneously. So I decided, or I found that I can buy just like magnet paper basically that I can put through the printer. So I'm going to try to print these at home and see how that works. And again, it is 9.02 and we leave for the airport at noon. So I have, a, and I still haven't packed yet. <laughs> so that's how I roll. Thanks for coming with me. Stay tuned to see if I can get it all done. And if we make this flight, because it's going to be insane. I know that's the way I roll, but that's just the way I roll because I don't know what else I could have done previously because we were in Maryland. So it's like, oh my gosh, this is kind of just how it all stacked up. So, all right, see you guys in a sec. I'm gonna go in the store. So I placed an online order because I wanted to make sure that the item, my magnets were available when I got here. Of course I get here and they're not, they're not here. They're hanging up like they're available, but it's a different price than the online order and they can't find my online order and I'm kind of in a hurry. All right, you guys, I'm back in the car and after an ordeal, the people, they were very friendly trying to figure it out. But I placed the online order this morning for the magnetic paper and got a confirmation number and everything. And then when I got there, it wasn't ready. And then they said, oh, it looks like the order's been canceled. Couldn't figure out why. I never got a cancellation on my side. They had it in, they had it in stock. So anyway, long boring story short, figuring all that out. And he's like, oh, well, the system, it looks like the system made a mistake and whatever. So um, I ended up purchasing it again and now I have it and they were also selling American flags it's almost 4th of July so I got two little American flags for our front lawn and then I had to pick up Mike's shirts which is right there from the dry cleaner so I'm gonna rush home it is now 9 52 almost 10 o'clock I have two hours we're leaving at 12 right I have two hours to pack for a seven day cruise to Alaska print out what do you call it magnetic um, signs for the doors 
and film my packing video. And there's one other thing I need to do. Oh, I did a video yesterday and I wanted to put some photos in them and I need to take pictures of the photos or scan the photos in somehow to get them into the video from yesterday. Some old photos of Mike and I when we first started dating. So anyhow, um, that is what I have to do and I'm hoping that I can get it all done by 12. This is where you start to prioritize and you're like, okay, if I can do this and this, all right, bye. So remember I said that last night I started packing. Okay, this is my suitcase that I brought back from Maryland. This is a dress I might bring with me. These are all the clothes I need to bring with me. I did seven nights of dinners. I did four days of excursions. I did a couple sea days. I have my poncho, some shoes. I can't decide if I should bring all these shoes, some of these shoes. Um, I also have boots. <laughs> so you guys, what I think I'm gonna do, I'm gonna try to fit it all into one carry-on and one checked bag. So I'm borrowing Katie's suitcase so I can check that. Um, I really don't know what to expect. The weather is supposed to be in Alaska. Um, highs in this like low 60s and lows in the low 50s. And it might has a chance of rain every day. But when we get to Seattle and we get on the boat, we're on the boat for the first day, it's gonna be 79 and sunny. So we can literally lay out by the pool. And then the next day as we head up into Alaska up north, it's gonna get um, gradually colder and colder. Um, so during the day though, it'll be nice enough that I don't have to be so bulky, but in the evening where you really want to wear your nice dresses and stuff is when it's going to be cold. So I kind of have to have cold dresses. So it's been a little bit of a mental game to try to figure out what I'm going to bring. And you bring a bathing suit too, because there's an indoor pool and there's hot tubs and they say, how cool is it to sit? I want to sit in the hot tub and look at a glacier. I don't know. Hopefully we'll be able to do that. I'm sure we'll be able to. I just don't know. It'll probably be full of the hot tubs or whatever, but, um, big beans. Okay, I'm packing two suitcases. I'm packing this suitcase down here and this suitcase up here, trying to put all that stuff in. And also, I told you before about our shirts. Let me show you my shirt. This is the box of shirts that came in. Some people ordered white, some people ordered blue. And I think somebody ordered a navy, yes. One person ordered a navy blue. So I'll open up mine so you guys can see what it looks like. I put together the logo and then offered, um, everybody to get they could get a t-shirt a sweatshirt this is like a long sleeve t-shirt so this is the front of it and this is the back of it this is the logo and our, our my maiden last name and so our family's last name is hamer so it's hamers on ice halaska 2023 you get it like hamer hamer laska combined and also hot like it's going to be fun and funny halaska 2023 so that is my long sleeve t-shirt and I'm gonna wear that um, on boarding day tomorrow so be sure to check out the boarding video when I get on the cruise but in the meantime I also have to pack yes uh, this box with all of these shirts I'm not sure if I should just check the box I don't <laughs> get it check the box but I don't I don't think that these are all gonna fit in my suitcase because I have so many things already to put in my suitcase so let me start to do that <laughs> Things are coming together. I've got all bags packed. Mike has his bag packed. They are starting to move. Brennan is actually packing the car with them right now. There he is. Hi, Brennan. Thanks for packing the car. He's so amazing. He's driving us to the airport, which is very nice. And in the meantime, I am printing these um, door um, magnets and they are turning out spectacular. I've only printed two so far and I hope we have enough ink to last for the rest. But look, this is, look at that. It's a door magnet. That's two. So I gotta print three more and they take quite a while to print and we have to leave in 10 minutes. So I am working down to the wire. All right, let's see. On our way to the airport, Brennan is our Uber driver. Hi, Brennan. Hello. Mike and I are hanging out in the back seat. We're starting our anniversary now, right? Would you say? Our anniversary celebration? I mean, I guess it started yesterday. It's over. No, <laughs> uh, it is not over. We're going, you guys, we're flying to Seattle. I think I already told you this this morning, but we're flying to Seattle tonight and then spending the night and then getting on the cruise ship tomorrow. So I was going to get coffee in Seattle. Uh, Seattle's best. Is or gonna, Starbucks. Is it going to rain? <laughs> all the Starbucks. Oh, yeah. All the Seattle things. That's pretty much Seattle. That's pretty it's much Seattle. Exactly. It's actually a really cool city, though. I've been there once before. 
Yeah, yeah you we threw some fish or something, I didn't did, you? Yes. That was awesome. The water day fish, I think. And the uh, space needle. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Yeah, so we're, so my parents and my sister and my brothers and their spouses are all flying into Seattle tonight too. So we're staying in the same hotel tonight and then all going to caravan over to the cruise ship tomorrow morning. So Brennan is going to hold down the fort. He and Ryan are going to take care of the kitties. Katie is still in Maryland and then she's headed to Minnesota. So we are going to be all over. Burr, Burr is right. <laughs> <laughs> Brennan, what's your plan for while we're gone? Um, I work Friday. Mm -hmm. I might golf on Saturday. Oh, nice. <sighs> Sunday, I'll go to church. I'll probably work out. Mm -hmm. A lot of working out, a lot of work. Mm -hmm. And work out, work, and golf. That's pretty much what I do this summer. That, that sounds like a pretty good summer. Sign me up. It's sign me up, too. <laughs> oh, my gosh. I wish I could golf as much as you're golfing. That's, that's awesome. Well, I need to get more balls because the more I golf, the more balls I lose. Oh, all right. So, so you gotta work harder, or not work harder, but just work, get a or paycheck. Just be, or just be better at all. Yeah, that would, yes, or that, or that. Okay, off to the airport. I am editing as we speak, and soon, I am gonna be on the plane though, and I will be on the Southwest plane, so I am going to listen to what the flight attendant <laughs> say. And um, do you think I should um, let the flight attendant know that I'm a. Excuse me. Hey, 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 exactly what you're supposed to say. So we're supposed to talk about the life rafts. <laughs> you didn't say the life rafts. So yeah. And you know what? You're supposed to smile. <laughs> so that's what I read. I <laughs> <laughs> I've got very good news. You know what good news is? We got everything done we needed to get done. We printed the door magnets. Oh. Um. We packed all of our suitcases. Boom. We had more than we thought we were gonna. We have three suitcases and a box. Boom. <laughs> I took the pictures and got them in the video, uploaded the video. Boom. And we are at the airport. And Crushed look at it. there's our plane right there, and it hasn't even left yet. We haven't even boarded it. We're not even running the plane we're like not, usually. I know. Right? I had enough time to go get some food. Like, what the heck? It's I know. Boring. It you is missed boring. It. I know. <laughs> Shoot. We should start all over again. Yeah. Alright you guys, we're gonna jump on the plane and head to Seattle. Fun times. We've landed in Denver. As it turns out, our flight is Okay, it's a little bit windy up here, you guys, but if you've ever been to Denver Airport, they have an outside area, which I think is 100% genius. Of course, it's windy here. It'll be so, then it's so nice to go to the outside, you know? And they have it here. It's so cool. We hung out outside here at Denver Airport when we traveled as a family on the RV trip. Um, I can put a link into that at the end of this video so you guys can see that. But look behind me this is such a cool piece of art that when the wind blows those little things go can you see that wait let me turn around can you see like way back there it is so cool it almost looks like it's supposed to be like wheat i think that's probably what it's supposed to look like all right we're gonna go back inside and eat we just sat over there and had an iced tea i had iced tea mike had a beer and now we're gonna go back into the gate our flight is delayed two hours, so we're kind of just wasting time. It's kind of fun though. Three hours later. All right, you guys, can you tell that I'm totally like losing it? I am so tired. It is 8.30 at night. We are still in the airport. We just wasted four hours here. Not wasted, we had a great time. We did, you know, had dinner and all that stuff. Anyway, um, it is 10.30 our time at home, which is not normally the time I go to bed, but last night I was packing until 4.30 in the morning, getting all my stuff, not, like getting all my stuff ready to pack, until 4.30 and I slept for three hours and then I get up and started the day. So I'm very, very tired, hoping to get on the plane, fall asleep, get back to the hotel, do some editing, and then tomorrow we get up and go. I know. I know. So this is the deal. So my parents are meeting us there. My brothers and my sister and all of them are delayed except for my sister, right? So they're gonna get in late too. But I think we're gonna be the latest people. <laughs> Uh, 
<laughs> All right, we made it to Seattle. See Jack, if you're cool. Yeah, that's right. I would say, how long? what time did we start traveling? At two? It's almost been 12 Last hours. Thursday. Yes, exactly. Okay. Yeah, it's an adventure. It's, it's all good. I it's all good. Deal. Nope. There was no complaining. No. We had Just, a nice time. I, I oh, time yeah. You know what? As long as we're together, I don't care. Happen. Yeah. Very fun. Yeah. I'm so bummed because the whole time we were coming here, we ha were texting back and forth with my family, like, where are you? Where are you? Sending pictures. Oh, we're already landed or we're delayed or we're at the airport, whatever. So we were all getting excited because our plan was we were all going to meet here at the hotel. We're meet in the lobby and have some cocktails and start our vacation. Well, with all the delays and everything that happened, we were ended up being the last people in. I think we were supposed to be the second people in, but we were the last of five. And along the way, my phone um, ran out of juice right after we got to Seattle airport. So I didn't even get to film like the reunion, like all of us do like, hey, hey, hey. But anyway, everybody's gone to bed now and I'm back in the room. Mike is also going to bed. He's not asleep yet, but he's over there in bed. Yes, I am. <laughs> Good night, Mike. <laughs> Good night, sweet dreams. I love you. So I'm happy to report that everything went off the way, without a hitch, as they say. Everything went the way it was supposed to go, and except for the flight delays, but that's okay. No big deal. And we made it here, and tomorrow we start on our big cruise. So, But if you'd like to see a video where the whole family was traveling to a cruise in the Mediterranean, go ahead and watch this video and this playlist, our Mediterranean cruise playlist. It is so much fun. It was a trip of a lifetime.